Hey everyone, this is Amal from VNC project team. In this video, we're going to show you what's going to happen in case a customer disapproves a solution suggested by the support organization. For this example, we're going to use this ticket 14069. Um, this is an active ticket, which means um, one of the support team members are working on it and soon they will provide you with a solution. So, um, so far by the customer, it's an active ticket. I'm going to sign out, log in. Um, with SP leader, um, the support consultant who's working on fixing it now. By his side, uh, it has the status assigned. Um, so um, from his side, I'm going to click on solve, try to search um, or select one of the um, solutions uh, available here. Uh, for example, for example, this one for installation, you need to install something like that. And I'm going to click on save. So now it has the status waiting for customer approval. Sign out. Um, log in as a customer. Go into his, uh, to, the, to the list of requests of the customer. Go into waiting approval. Okay, I'm going to see what is the suggested solution. Uh, for the installation, no, this is uh, my error is in pop up uh, 3 and it, it doesn't have to do with the installation. So I'm going to click on disapprove. I'm going to say, for example, this um, did not help. My issue has to do with email configuration, configuration and not um, installation. So I'm going to click on submit. My ticket now is back to active. OK, so I will go back to the same uh, last support consultant who worked on it, see what the change uh, from his side. Now he's going to see it under assigned. It's going to go back from waiting approval uh, into assigned because the solution was disapproved. Um, he can see. OK, that was my uh, the suggested solution by the support consultant. OK. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now this did not help my issue, has to do with the email configuration, not the installation. He read the note sent by the customer, the reason why he disapproved um, the solution. Okay, so now he can try working on it again, try to suggest another solution. In this case, he's going to create now another solution, make it, make it global so other people can use it. Um, he can say, um, pop up uh, three port 80 for example and he can say um, to fix this issue you need you need um, to use the port 80 okay so I'm gonna click on save now it's back into waiting for customer approval sign out sign in as a customer to verify the solution now it's back. Okay, I can see. Okay. I can see the other use resolution. To fix this issue, you need to use the port 80. Okay, so as a customer, I can try this solution. Let's say that now I can approve it because it helped fixing my issue. So I'm going to click on approve. Now it's completed.